Hi, welcome to Sister with a Purpose, where I give you uplifting, motivational messages, and I let you know what's going on. So guys, I'm just checking in real quick and seeing what you need to know right now from my lowdown deck, okay? And then I'm going to clarify with the essential tarot. All right, we're going to keep it. I'm going to try to keep it as a quick video. So yeah, let's see. Thank you for all of my donations, monetary donations. Thank you so much. Okay, um, thank you so much for supporting the channel, for liking this video. And go ahead and check out my second channel. The description, the link to that, um, damn, I can't even say it. The link to that channel is in my description box. Okay, it's called Devil Divinity, all Taurus and Gemini placements. Wherever you have Taurus and Gemini, or if you're a divine feminine and you resonate with your sun sign, moon sign, rising sign. Okay, being a Taurus Gemini. Let's jump right in. What does the Divine Feminine need to know tonight? What does she need to know concerning this particular day? Divine Spirit, Most High, thank you, Most High Divine Spirit, Divine Brothers, Divine Gods. Allow me to come on again, channel, Mr. Truth, Love, Light, Accuracy. What is it that she needs to know from this day? If not, I'm going to move forward. Please allow the messages to fall on the table. Thank you. Frenemy vibes. Okay, so you have a frenemy somewhere in the shadows that you need to know. I hope they fail, then I will feel better about myself. True magician. So this person is uh, doing some type of alchemy or some magician work, um, hoping and, and trying to speak ill on your life and, and your goals. Someone who you consider a friend. I'm here that you don't even know this person is a frenemy. Yeah, look at this. Didn't I say they was doing some type of alchemy some type of magician work yeah they tried to hex you frenemy vibes okay this person tried to hex you i hope they fail and i will feel better this is someone who don't have shit going on in their life that's what you need to know someone's trying to hex you but you can't hex what god has blessed i only want to use you so yeah this person only wants to use you please be full so i can have my way this person only wants to use you they want to fool you into thinking that they love you and they care about you, but they don't. Anything else that the Divine Feminine needs to hear tonight? Gossip. This person could be gossiping about you, so what you tell them, they going to the next person. We got gossip. Damn, my practitioner warned me. They said I was wrong for going against you. Didn't I just say no one can hex what God has blessed? So, yeah. They've already know, they already know that they can't do nothing. They just hoping that you fail on your own. But they um they already know that they can't do nothing. Their hands are tied. And if they do do something, then you know that's they ass. And this is why they're broke with bad karma. This is why they're hoping and, and wishing for you to fail. So they will feel better about being stuck in this energy. This person is broke with bad karma. Listen to music. I feel like so you'll have a message or confirmation through music about who this person is to you. If you don't already know, whoever you're thinking about right now, it's that person. But if you don't know, you need to listen to music. They treated you like an option. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that was a quick message. But you. God, you are my healer and help help in time of need. Divine favor is yours, okay? But I, I was going to say you are a healer, and I feel like this person, yes, look, 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 the empress. Of course you're a healer. You're an abundant, abundant nurturer, okay? You're the true magician. You're the empress. But anyways, this person didn't want you to heal or be able to heal. Look at this, the fool. So you've been blessed with some type of new beginning, but they hope you fail on this new beginning, this new endeavor that the divine has blessed you with. They want you to literally walk off a cliff. You see how this person is walking off a cliff? Sorry about that. I got a notification on my phone. But you see how this person is getting ready to blindly walk off on a cliff? That's what they want you to do. So they can feel better about themselves. And be like, well, I tried to, like, warn them. Nah, fuck your warning. Okay, broke with bad karma. Thank you so much, John Spirit. 
The King of Pentacles at the top of the deck. Yeah, this person is soul searching. Look, ooh, does she in anxiety too? Because you got the Ace of Pentacles. This person is soul searching in hermit mode, trying to figure out what and where did they go wrong to have so much karmic debt racked up. Okay, look, this person is in anxiety because they know their practitioner had already warned them and told them not to go against you. But it's like the moment they went against you, all they did was make you pregnant with opportunity, pregnant with um, whatever financial or creative endeavor that you had. All they did was amplify that for you. You could be getting ready to have or give birth to a project or an actual child. So they're gossiping about this um, new financial opportunity you have. Yeah, you've been reaping what you sow. I'm here a week later than superstars. No, it ain't safe for you. So the eight of pentacles, the ace of pentacles, ace of pentacles and the seven of pentacles is the eight of pentacles. So you've been mastering your abundance. You've been minding your business. I'm hearing that you've been listening to a lot of music. And it keeps you focused on what you need to do. Can I have one for they treat it? You like an option? The Ace of Wands. Yeah, they went towards all these new Ace of Wands opportunities. Yeah, oh my gosh. I seen the King of Pentacles and I thought about the Two of Pentacles, but I didn't say nothing. And here go the Two of Pentacles right here. All that juggling that they were doing. They were juggling. Look at this. I can't make this up. This King of Wands. They went to it. They treated you like an option because they were too busy juggling their wand, their passion for other people in one hand, and then trying to come around you in another aspect. Okay, this is for somebody who could have look at you, somebody you was in a relationship with. Okay, for some of you all, this is an actual friendship that you were a part of, but for others of you all, this was your divine counterpart. And they were too busy giving out their wand in other places. Okay. Woo. I just didn't read it. They were too busy giving out their wand in other places, doing other things. Look at the bigger picture. There could be a Sagittarius who needs to look at the big, bigger picture here. Or an Aries. So this is what you need to know. This friend in me, they're broke with bad karma. They've already been warned to go against you. Everything that they did helped you. It's like you ate that shit whole. And you became pregnant with more life. You know, it's like they gave you more energy instead of depleting and replenishing your energy. They gave you energy. Okay, but I'm hearing that you, yes, come through then. I was getting ready to say, I'm hearing that, yeah, they want you to fail, but you will not fail. You won't fail because you got self-love. You have integrity. You have morals. You're compassionate. You're satisfied with everything that you do. So there's no failing. There's only lessons to be gained. You will come out to be the king of pentacles. While they're sitting up here wishing that you weren't, want you to be in this two of pentacles energy with them, you're going to be exalted and elevated over this individual. All right, divine feminine, divine masculine, this is the reading for this particular video. And until next time, I will definitely catch you in your next one. Thank you so much for your support. All right, thank you for liking. Um, until next time, be well. Ashe. Bye.